Yeah. So of course that means you know that's how we're trying to avoid all the risks and uh, those kind of concerns. But of course the next problem is of course the quality. Yeah. They know that when they do it back in the home in Australia, they have full control of everything. Uh, they're gonna have full control. They know they're gonna have you know at least they they control the quality of the of the outcome. How do we work on that? How do we make sure that they don't lose quality using us? From the very beginning, we ensure that there's a really great interviewing process or application process because that allows us to hire the right people. Um, from that process, we actually involve the client as well so that they're always going to be part of um, who they're going to be choosing, who they're going to be working with. They're actually uh, hiring their own staff, not just hiring people that they have no idea who they are and what type of personality or characteristics they have. Uh, when they start working with us, there's always going to be some training, there's always going to be some refresher, there's always going to be a way for us to measure performance. So quality-wise, we'll always have to be what the client expects or even actually exceeds whatever the client is expecting. Um, more often than not, the experience is that the Filipinos or you know, whenever they outsource, they're, they're actually done better. So that's of course uh, one of the key factors for our growth as well. If our clients wouldn't be happy with our services and the quality wouldn't be good enough, yeah. uh, they wouldn't grow from two to ten people uh, and they wouldn't be keep using us. Um, so I said that, and the fact that the, the way we've been growing, of course, uh, is an evidence that we're keeping up the quality.